Allora, considerando che questo è un social, facciamo qualcosa di diverso. Solite cavolate, comunque andiamo a fare le cose diverse. Andiamo subito a trovare. Una rassegna dei momenti più importanti dell'anno, vissuti su Facebook, l'anno 2014 in breve. Andiamo a scoprirlo. for something where you're into it and there is a beauty to it that profound sense of wonder and that big thing is that people need each other I think that's how we get through life you know, laugh, you can deal with it love, it doesn't just hold love liberates Jews and Arabs refuse to be enemies, and there's dozens more pictures and stories. At the time when no one speaks, your voice gets so loud that everyone has to hear it. The most powerful force on this planet is human cooperation. Stop defining each other by what we are not, and start defining ourselves by who we are. We can all be freer.
And after I dump this bucket of ice on my head, I get to nominate three new people to challenge. So I'm going to challenge Bill Gates, my partner in Facebook, Sheryl Sandberg, and Netflix's founder and CEO, Reed Hastings. I'm glad to give ALS. It's a great cause, but I, I want to accept this challenge. I want to do it better than it's been done. Been working on this. No, got this design. There we go. Yeah. It's going to be great. I'm here to join the people bringing attention to Lou Gehrig's disease by taking the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. I'm going to challenge three more people, Elon Musk, Brian Seacrest, and Chris Anderson of TED. Consider yourself challenged. You have 24 hours. Good luck. <laughs> Good <night. laughs> Bella, <laughs> mamma mia. Sto Before this summer, most people weren't talking about ALS. All it took to change everything was a challenge. You gonna do this ice bucket challenge? I accept the challenge. Challenge accepted. Right. No one could have predicted this amount of attention for ALS. But we're incredibly grateful to everyone who was willing to stand up to a disease that steals your ability to walk, talk, and even breathe before it takes your life. I'm happy to donate to this very worthy cause. We can create awareness and change. Let's do this. Every video, every share, and every donation contributed to the greatest outpouring of support our cause has ever seen. On behalf of people living with ALS and their families, thank you. Thank you. Right now, in West Africa, Ebola threatens the lives of millions of people. As a father, I can't imagine what it must feel like seeing your child suffer and feeling so helpless. But there's something that you can do. UNICEF is on the ground working around the clock to protect children and families from this deadly virus. Please give UNICEF help <laughs> per le multinazionali. Il dubbio. What we're seeing now is not an outbreak or an epidemic of Ebola in America. We're a nation of more than 300 million people. To date, we've seen three cases of Ebola diagnosed here. Ebola is actually a difficult disease to catch. The only way that a person can contract the disease is by coming into direct contact with the bodily fluids of somebody who is already shot. Come on. Presidenta Tracy.
This woman was supposed to be on board Malaysia Airlines flight MH17, but didn't make it to the airport in time. She was en route for another flight when she learned the plane had crashed in eastern Ukraine. And I was like, uh, from, uh, from Hilton, the Hague, coming to the airport, and the taxi was just driving. I'm just thinking that I feel like I've been given a second chance, and so hopefully that will get there safely. And I don't want to see my family again. All 295 passengers on board MH17, which was headed.
condividiamolo ok chiudo il video credo di aver fatto qualcosa di diverso stop sono le 14.21 di domenica 21 febbraio 2015 chiudo saluti a tutti da Gino Spricillotti